Hey guys, Fire here from In Depth Gaming, bringing you another game review. This time we're checking out Mighty 8 Bit. This game is developed by Cascadia Games and published by Chili Dog Interactive and releases on June 25th, 2021 for a price of $4.99. Now, what is Mighty 8 Bit? It's simply a quick platformer game where you control a character going around trying to rescue civilians and defeating little enemy alien, you know, combatants on the level. As you play, you'll collect gems, which will kind of boost your little special power, and you'll try to avoid and dodge uh, different enemies to try to find and save, you know, the civilians that you need to pick up. As you proceed through the level, there's going to be a wide variety of enemies that you're going to encounter, but ultimately they all do pretty much the exact same thing. So it's just trying to find the civilians, don't die, and rinse and repeat that same style of mechanic for the game. As you find the civilians, they'll kind of either be caged up, could be infected by the little bug aphid looking guys or just a wide variety of things that you're going to encounter um, when you are playing you could end up gaining some special abilities where you'll get different forms for your gun to shoot or different like bullet spreads or the ability to kind of boost up and fly here spending the gems that you collect but for the most part it's just a rinse and repeat style game you're just going to be trying to kill enemies finding and rescuing the guys and then after each stage that you play you're going to fight a boss um, for the most part the game is fairly simple and that's kind of made easy with there being the traditional Chili Dog games, cheat codes that you can enter, which will give you a God Mode ability. Um, it's the same exact code, it's the uh, kind of up, up, down, down, triangle button combination that they've always used. So if you do want to, you know, look that up and make this game be an easy, quick cakewalk, you can do that. Um, there are probably plenty of guides out by the time this review comes out where you can quickly figure out how to do. Um, with a guide, doing it that way with the cheat code is probably going to take you somewhere around you know, about 30 to 40 minutes, um, maybe a little longer, maybe a little shorter, just kind of depends on how quick you uh, find all the various bad guys on the stage, as well as just getting to complete the bosses and not falling off the maps. Um, it can be pretty easy to fall off the map, and if you do fall off, you'll have to ultimately restart and try to resave all the civilians. Pretty much though, that is the gist of the game. It's rinse and repeat through six different stages while you're playing, then you're also gonna have to complete six different bosses. So these are the six different stages that you'll encounter. And that's the gist of the game. There isn't really anything else to add to the game. It's just going through those stages, completing those bosses, and taking out those enemies. Overall, it's a fairly simplistic game. I think the uh, you know nuance of trying to hunt and fight things. Um, the game does require a little bit of skill. A little challenging if you're not using the cheat code. But if you are using the cheat code, it's a complete cakewalk. Overall, if I have to give Mighty Aphid any type of, of a review score, I'm probably going to give the game about a 5 out of 10. It's okay. It's 5 bucks. It's a quick, easy completion. But there's plenty of games if you're looking for something to really, you know, dig your teeth into and have something fun to play. But if you're looking for a quick, easy gamer score game and, you know, you either want to use a cheat code or not, pick up Mighty Aphid. We've got a link in the description. It is pre-orderable at the time of this uh, video. So you can have that. Have any questions, as always, look forward to Enjoy the video. And if you haven't already, please consider subscribing. You have a great rest of your day, and we'll see you next time.